Hi, it's Chris. I'm here on the back of our boat, Poppy, on a fine, fine Thursday afternoon. It's been a cold, cold day. There's a hard frost this morning. Uh, and we're in the fort into the fortnight of the lockdown in England. Uh, it's a week to go, a week today. Uh, then the lockdown will be over, but he's announced today all the tier positions uh, in the country. And unfortunately, Staffordshire and Stoke on Trent are in tier three, which isn't good. So. I don't think it's a great deal different than the lockdown, to be honest with you. And that's going to be reviewed in another fortnight. Certainly three weeks today it'll be reviewed, which isn't good, but it's got to be combated, so we've got no choice. The only thing that upsets me is my daughter's 40 on uh, the 3rd, which is, uh, I think it's next Friday. I won't be able to see it. but like I say, there's a lot of hardship in the... Uh, that's just one of the things, and my son and his family have had it. I mean, they've got over it, thank goodness, but uh, it's certainly affecting most of us now. Uh, I've put some good videos up. Uh, I put one of Trenton lights. Uh, they switched the lights on last week, uh, and had a walk down the village. Uh, it's absolutely lovely. All the lights are on and the Christmas trees. The only problem is 90% of the shops are shut. Uh, there's just a few takeaways and uh, bits and bobs, but like I say, 90% of them are shut. And it's a drastic shame because coming up to November, December, it's there big time. That's where they big, make the big money. And with being in tier three, I don't suppose they'll be able to open then. So I don't think a, a lot of places will be able to go. You won't be opening again. I just hope I'm wrong and I just hope the government give enough support for them all. But like I say, we've, we've heard it in Manchester and... Uh, Liverpool, when they put them in tier three, still good luck to them. I say it's just a horrible situation. Then uh, I put one up last week. Uh, the, the summer, <laughs> happy memories of the summer. Uh, it was, I think it was June. We took Narrowbook Poppy out, and it's absolutely red hot. Uh, we went to the pub at night, and uh, it's just lovely to see a bit of sun. Like I say. It's, Last time it was locked down, at least the weather was okay, but now it's going dark at three and it's looking awful. <clears throat> so I, th I think a lot of people are suffering and uh, it's not nice at all. And uh, I made one at Rudyard. I went to the, you can see a bit now, the sun's gone up. <laughs> went to the old manor at the far end of the lake, Rushton Spencer. A uh, real spooky house that is. I, I wouldn't like to li live in there at all. But it's all derelict now, but I made a good video. Then I did one here, uh, doing lock 34 on the Trenton Mersey method, and they drained the canal, and I went and did a video of that. So, uh, like I say, it's fascinating to see the canals when they drain down, and I think lock 34 is having new gates on. They're still working on it now. Uh, so there's a few people at Aston Marina, the, but uh, it's dead now, absolutely dead. And like I say, it's, if it's going on the tier three uh, in a week's time, it's going to carry on being dead. And like I say, it's coming up to Christmas, the busiest time for businesses. So I wish them all the luck. I'll just turn the camera around now. There's Aston Marina. Not many people about at all. I say it's not a ripple on the water, which is very unusual here. It's uh, usually gusting. I say there's nobody about, there's just, you can tell when they're ending, they've got the chimneys going. I think there's one down there. Now about poppies are going as well. I'll just stoop that up. I don't know if you can tell. You've got to keep warm. Like I say, the sun's gone in now. Looks like it's going to be another cold night. So I all hope you're okay. And uh, it'll be over one day. It just seems such a long, it's been going for so long and it doesn't seem to be getting any better. So I uh, hope you're all fine. Keep subscribing and give me a thumbs up. Thank you. Bye.